So Hilltop is a lot more than just a glass program and going through middle school and high school it was just a safe community center where you can be yourself and make art. Um, I am Jack Spitzer and I am a student in the Hilltop Artist Program. Um, this year we're making centerpieces for our annual luncheon. Uh, this year for our centerpieces I designed the bowls with the help of the instructors and we are making assorted low bowl shapes. Um, the bowls are going to have two bubbles that get joined together to make the bowl and that's called an encalmo. Um, the bottom half of the bowl is a roller wrap in a solid color and the top half is a transparent that matches that color and the lip wrap matches the bottom color wrap. When I was in middle school and I started um, in the Hilltop Artist program and I loved it and I moved into the after school program, you know, I, um, I enjoy woodworking and working on cars and glass blowing. So I'm super hands on and I really enjoy challenging things, skilled, you know, the woodworking, fine woodworking and the technical mechanics and glass blowing is extremely technical and, and skillful and uh, that's really what attracts me to it is, is being really good and kind of being able to control the bubble. I learned from older kids in the program that were mentors and that's kind of what happens when you go through the program is you kind of start as a student and kind of work your way up and, and you really become a mentor to the younger kids. And I try to do my best to be a positive you know, influence and, and uh, kind of role member to the younger kids. And um, I learned that from the museum team, you know, because that's kind of what they do to us. They are mentors and they you know, teach us glass blowing and communication and, and teamwork. And it's, it's really important in the hot shop to have good communication and teamwork. And if you watch us, you'll notice we're always talking and um, communicating about timing and, and the process and what's next and you know starting the next piece before we finish the, the, the final product. This year I have decided I am going to pursue glass blowing and be a glass blower and live, live the dream. So I got to figure out how, how to do it and uh, you know those are just the small details but it's been it's been yeah kind of trying to you know think about pursuing glass or not and I think at this point I, I kind of have to I just I enjoy it so much I, I have to to try to do it.